Good morning, afternoon, evening, starting out solitary. It is week 234, and we are talking about witchy idols. Um, so I'm going to repeat something that most of the other people have said this week, and it's that I don't really have witchy idols. However, I think that comes from being in the practice so long. Um, when I first started out, there were lots of people that I looked up to. Um, Raymond Buckland, Scott Cunningham for his infinite knowledge, Starhawk, um, Lori Cabot, um, Christopher Penzak a little bit later. Um, I mean, Fiona Horn, which we've talked about a little bit, but as I grow in my practice, the, I gain enough knowledge and experience that my practice becomes my own and therefore those people are no longer held to that higher standard. I, I'm past the point of that learning. Um, I've learned and gleaned what I can from those people and have incorporated in my practice. I think that the people that have come before us, much like Drew said, um, definitely deserve a reverence. And there are numerous people here on YouTube that started back with me in 2008 and have returned, um, much like myself. And there are people who came after me um, who are the reason that I came back. Um, some of those people are Molly Roberts and Kellyanne Maddox and um, Avalon and Sam and... Piper and Alora Rain. I mean, it, the community has gotten so big now that I think it's important as people who have been in the community the longest, not, not necessarily the longest, as people who have been in the community a long time, I think it's important for us to represent ourselves and be open to helping others. Um, get to a point where they don't necessarily need witchy idols either. Um, if they want to continue to put us on that pedestal, great. But I think it's important with so much mainstream attention going on to witchcraft and what is witchcraft and BuzzFeed and all these documentaries and all these things, I think it's important for us to be a wealth of knowledge that we experienced in a new format and help explore that for the newer generations um, and I don't think anybody sets out to be an idol or somebody's role model but I think that's just the progression of the cycle so that's really all I have to say on that topic and I will see you guys next week here on Stardew Solitary.